Iron CV full time for the dead. Your wardrobe just thrives and thrives week oh. on week. See, I've gone for the jumper and shirt today. No, 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 at all. Snapback today. I've got, I've gone all, got all classy today. Just, just for uh, keep your own, you yeah. know. Yeah. Why um, not? But honestly, um, that is a for me. I, I know it won't be the best performance, but yeah. there was something about, um, as Nick said, that word sheer mill wellness. That's yeah. that's what I felt yeah, there was, was today. Um, I felt the game today summed uh, Steve Morrison up. I felt that was it's a, it was a right sort of game for him to get involved in, and what a game for him to score his first goal. Yeah. Well, I slagged him off in the first. I said he'd give every single ball away, but obviously, what do I know? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, I think. Um, He's uh, he's he's effort on essay, but he just he just battled. He just he, he battled quite a lot in the air, and he was winning quite a lot of headers. But I tell you what, Dan, honestly, sh- uh, special mentions to Sean Hutchinson and Jed Wallace, even Ryan Tuncliffe, I think as well. I think Sean Hutchinson, after watching him for a while, I think he's a proper Millwall player. Yeah. He don't he don't bottle out of anything. Honestly, I think I think he's quality, and I thought um, Jed Wallace say, I, I felt like when, when's he going to run out of energy? Honestly, yeah, yeah. just kept on running, kept on running, and you know. Um, and right. Ryan trying to keep fucking no yeah. <laughs> Fucking no Say no more. I don't want to say. Cheers, and uh, Ryan Tunnicliffe was just dispatching the balls every. I thought it was just, yeah, we just we just battled and we worked hard. Yeah, yeah. first half, I mean, first half, I was thinking, what am I going to say here at the end? But for second half, we come out and, and someone said to me, you know, it works both ways. The players need to give the fans something to, to sing about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And we was up for it second half. Like I said, it wasn't pretty, but nah. we got the job. The extras have gone home, but job yeah. done. <laughs> job done. Steve Morrison, what a time to get your first goal of the season. Oh, definitely. And the thing is, I thought, do you know, there was a time I thought he's never going to get it, but then I thought today. Uh, before, before the start of the game I just thought if there's ever going to be a game for him to score I said it's going to be against yeah. I've got, I call him the Holloway so I don't care about QPR Ian Holloway he hit in that dugout certainly after that first yeah. goal didn't he yeah. and to be honest you know um, there weren't uh, I, f- I felt like obviously everyone got into the game a bit more there weren't too much focus on Holloway after a while everyone really really wanted the uh, the three points more than giving him stick but after that goal went in I mean he was gone. He was hit hiding yeah. in that dugout. But I'm so glad we got the three points. We've um, we're really building on this own form, Dan. Yeah. I think um, we're so so strong at home. And if you notice, all the managers um, when they're uh, on, on, the, on the opposite side, they're always saying in their pre-match press conferences, they go, "Oh, like, we really don't want to come down, Mill. They don't fancy it." Um, and we're a really really tough side when we get going. Down we're here. even we're even stronger at home this year than we was last yeah, that, year. Yeah. All right, the players have helped Savile, Meredith again, all superb. But it's, it's just saying about this place. Listen, forget forget the fucking hanging baskets of Babylon. On Stone Ends, this guy right here is the eighth wonder of the world. Oh, exactly. And uh, like you just said, um, I thought I think we're much better at home this season because, uh, like, like you said, we, we recruited in the right areas. Um, I think the decisions that he made today were very key um, in terms of McLaughlin was obviously injured, but Romeo coming. I thought Romeo done uh, yeah. done a good job. Uh, Tunnicliffe was was brilliant today, and uh, and Morrison obviously um, it weren't pretty, but he got the goal, and that's what matters at the end of the day. Yeah. But um, um, at the end of the day, Dan, we got the three points, and that's all that matters. And we're looking up now. We're not looking. We, we've beaten them a day. That was something of a six-pointer, really. We're, we're yeah. well clear now. I think relegation, we can not worry about. It. I think we're we're done now. We're, we're safe, pretty much. Yeah. We just got we just got to build on that into the new year, Dan. And like I said, get the striker, get a wing, get a striker, and get a winger that likes running at midfoot, uh, like running at defenders, like Jed does. Yeah. Once we do that, Dan, we get get half decent because like there's been mentions on Twitter and stuff about like this Lloyd Dyer and stuff like that. No. I think that's what. Yeah, I, I don't. Yeah, I, I don't want to talk too much about that. We got we got a sign in the right ears, and I think Harris, he's got he's got a good eye for players. I think now now so um, I think yeah, get them players in, build on the home form, start getting a few more points away from home, and we'll be sweet, Dan. Yeah, we'll do. Well done, mate. Well done. Good night. Well done, mate.